If you ever wondered how to leverage the power of ChatGPT, the AI language model to creating compelling, creating app for your channel, you are in the right place. In this video, I will guide you through the process of how to make an app with the help of ChatGPT, capabilities and some of other AI tools. So let's dive in and unlock the potential of AI as a step. But before we begin, let me tell you guys that we have regular updates on multiple technologies videos. So if you are a tech geek on a continuous hunt for the latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and press that bell icon to never miss any update from Simply Learn. Also, accelerate your career in AI ML with comprehensive postgraduate program in AI and ML, gain expertise, machine learning, deep learning, NLP, computer vision and reinforcement learning. You will receive a prestigious certificate, exclusive alumni membership and hackathons and AMA sessions by IBM. With three capstone and 25 plus industry project using real data sets from Twitter, Uber and more. You will gain practical experience. Master classes by Purdue faculty and IBM expert ensure top notch education. Simply and job assist help you to get noticed by leading companies live session on AI trends like ChatGPT, Generative AI and Explainable AI. This program covers statistics, Python supervised and unsupervised learning, NLP, neural network, computer vision, GAN, SCARES, TensorFlow and many more skills. So why wait and roll now and unlock exciting AI and ML opportunity. The course link is in the description box below. Let's dive in and see how ChatGPT can help you to make a great app. So here we have ChatGPT okay you can write here chat.openai.com so here i will ask to chat gpt what is chat gpt so i will here write what is chat gpt so here you can stop generating if you want to okay i will stop generating okay so chat gpt is a conversational artificial intelligence model developed by OpenAI. It is based on the GPT generative pre-trained transform architecture specifically GPT 3.5, which is an advanced language model. So GPT 3.5 is trained on a massive amount of text data to generate human like response to wide range of prompts and questions. You can ask anything to chat GPT. Okay. After coming chat GPT software developers are safe software developer jobs are safe like nothing <clears throat> see yes after the introduction of chat gpt and similar language models software developers still have important roles and their jobs remain relevant while ai models like chat gpt can generate text and provide automated response they have limitations See, they have limitations, chat GPT have limitations and cannot repl replace the skills and expertise of human software developers. So here is a few reasons why software developer jobs remain valuable. Okay, so here are the few reasons. So you can ask anything to chat GPT. So what we will do, we will create a small, small gaming app. Okay, so here I will write, uh, let's make first tic-tac-toe okay so here i will write give me the code for tick tac toe game see it will give you the step by step chat gpt will explain you everything see this board then player check columns check diagonals play game everything see check for the winner play game everything see to play the game simply run the python script players will take turns entering the row column numbers to make their moves the game will okay so what i will do okay first i will ask the steps to make a game tic-tac-toe okay give me these steps to Game, see first it will uh, we will ask for these steps then we will ask for the code 
chat gpt can make your app in two three minutes in just two three minutes small small app in two three minutes okay see what what is the first step set up the game board create a data structure to represent the tic-tac-toe board this can be three by three grid or nested list with initial empty values okay for example this then second is the print the game board write a function to display the current state of the board on the screen this will help player visualize their game and the third is get player input from the player to enter their moves accept the input for the rows and columns where the players want to place their symbol x or zero okay or you can change the value x or zero whatever cross right okay update the board after receiving the player input update the game board with their move make sure to validate the move and check if the selected position is empty okay then check for the winner then check for it is draw or what then alternate turns okay then repeat two to seven until the game ends optional add additional features we will first we will make tic-tac-toe uh, uh, what you can say a simple tic-tac-toe then we will add the additional features on this okay using chat gpt only okay so i will write provide me the tic tac to game code what we will do we will uh, open the visual studio and copy it directly okay see current player is x then o see current player o the second player switch player okay what we will do we will copy it from here and we will open see visual studio that new file i will write here tick tag to dot p1 okay enter i will save it so here i will directly copy the code where is my code oh it's, it comes in okay copied this also copied the whole thing okay i have to remove this or i can make it you know comment yeah so let's try to run it what terminal says see enter the row okay two enter the column two okay it made like this okay what i will do i will ask for the gui <coughs> uh, provide me the tic tac to game with gui okay now the tinker came tinker is python library used for the gui in python okay okay now uh, we'll copy the code and just paste it it will run okay with gui and then we will add the additional features okay from here now i am copying the code now select all replace with this code like here no error no red sign so let me play it it will run i guess no problems okay what happened see as you can see we got the tic tac toe game okay so see here x zero x zero x player x wins so let me add the additional features in this so what we will do we'll go to chat gpt again we'll ask for the additional feature see note the code above uses the message box module from the tinker for displaying messages ensure that you have compatible version to tinker okay when you run this code a graphical windows will appear by three by three grip and this uh, okay players can click on the buttons to make their move the game state will okay <clears throat> okay 
अपडेट यू कैन यू नो टॉक टू चैट जी पी सो आई आई विल से अपडेट माई कोड विथ सम गुड फोन एंड स्कोर बोर्ड स्कोर बोर्ड फोन स्कोर बोर्ड एंड कलर अपडेट माई जी यू आई कोड आई कैन राइट Here is an updated. See, right. Certainly, here is an updated version of GUI code with improved font, scoreboard, and color. If you get error in this, you can ask to Chat GPT. Okay. Anything you are facing issue about your code, whatever it is, you can ask directly to Chat GPT. See, we created an app in like two minutes, just in two minutes. so chat gpt is making our life easier okay let me copy this code okay let's see the changes what what chat chat gpt does okay is nothing changed i guess player expands like this cross okay okay so uh, i will write here see in this updated code the font style has been improved with a bold arial font the buttons have a custom background color and the overall window and its cover have a different color oh i didn't feel like this i didn't feel like this <coughs> okay so change Uh, the grid style of the game. It's giving updating the board. See to change the grid style of the same, you can modify appearance of the buttons and the spacing between them. Here is an updated version GUI code with a modified grid style. it's just a little bit of time taking that's it nothing else it's very useful chat gpt you can create your app in 2 3 minutes only okay continue generating it's a half code the code is copied let me select and paste it here and check see player x 0 player o 0 okay it's little bit different i guess x okay this 1 2 3 box why these lines there okay who cares Player experience. Okay, see the scoreboard is updated. Okay, so this is how you can make your tic tac toe more beautiful. Okay, uh, let me write here. Let me write here. I want the black and white boxes. Okay, or colorful boxes. So, um, good. provide me the code for the colorful boxes okay okay here chat gpt wrote certainly here is an updated version of the code with colorful boxes instead of grid lines okay so wait waiting for the code update the code See in this updated code, each player's button X and O has a specific color assigned to it. The button colors. Okay, let me copy the code and paste it here and run it. See, the color is changed. 
Then I will write C X and O X O X O X player X wins. Okay. So this is how you can make your app more beautiful, beautiful using customization. You can ask chat GPT anything, color, style, font, or any function. Anything you can ask and you, you can make your app more beautiful. Okay. So now let's move on to the next uh, game, which I want a snake game. Okay, using pie game we will make. So here I will write, please provide me the code of snake game using pie game Python. Okay. Everyone knows what is a snake game. <coughs> or first you want to ask the steps we can ask the steps okay after this i will ask this step okay so till then let's make a new file of snake game dot py okay let me close it see it's a long code I guess just continue generating now you can see the see the food and all will come okay you can ask anything like any question any language question this code sets up the basic structure for the snake game using Pygame it includes a functionality for displaying the snake controlling this movement detecting collision with the boundaries and food and managing the score you can run the code and play the snake game with pi game window feel free to customize see at the end what chatgpt wrote feel free to customize and enhance the game according your preference okay that is what i was talking about you can change n number of times you can ask n number of times for the code new new code okay there is one why this error is coming Mm, import by game could not be resolved by lens what is this by lens okay let me ask to chat GPT only what is by lens by lens is a language server for python developed by microsoft it provides the one's language features including code completion type checking Static analysis and code navigation capability. Pylance is built on the top of language server. Okay. Let me give the error itself. Copy message. Okay. I will write debug error. Pylance. Okay. Make sure you have a Pygame installed. Pygame is already installed on my okay, install in a Python environment. Open your command prompt or terminal and run the following command. Okay, let me open the command prompt. Okay, then what I have to write? Let me copy the code and paste it here. What is this? Okay, version C. This is this is this. If Pygame is not installed, you can reinstall by running. Already installed, I guess. Oh, ensure the PyLens is using the correct Python interior. Verify that PyLens is configured to use the same path which you have installed by game. You can check the Python interpreter setting in your code editor or id which make sure it's point to correct path environment where pi game is installed okay what i will do i will go to terminal and here i will write pip install 
fire. Okay. Maybe it will be helpful. Okay, let me do this. What chat is better? Pip install by game. Okay, successful install new pip. Some error of by game, I guess. Okay, we'll run it online, no worries. If it won't work in this, I will run it online. Okay. Six C the requirement is already satisfied in this 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 so what we will do uh, we will open the applet okay we'll open the applet and we'll create the new repl okay then python and create it <coughs> okay this is the same like you know one of the ID you can say okay. then what I will I will copy this space code and paste it here okay I will make a new file its name dot py okay on that I will copy the code and I will run it okay Separate updating the package and the poetry and the pie game. Okay, it's running, the code is running. Okay, it's installing pie game. Okay, let me run now. What happened? What's the error? What's the error? Okay. Let me. Okay. Some um, hello from Pi Game community. This Pi Game dot org. There's one file main dot file and my. Some game loop module file main dot pli sixty eight okay okay we'll ask to chat GPT <coughs> snake game code showing feather Okay, provide me the snake game code using Python GUI. This time from turtle. Okay, let's see. Because the Pi games, I don't know Pi game is installed on my system. It's not working, so we will leave it. Okay, we'll ask from the uh, some good GUI with some good GUI. Seriously, the head, everything is there. The keyboard bindings from WSD, or you can up, down, left, right the keys. You can use from use the both. Okay, continue generating. Then the functions, the pen, the snake body, everything is here. Snake head is like everything is here. What you want, everything is here. See the code utilize the turtle module to be, create the basic game with the snake, then moves, collect food. The, the score is displayed. Okay, feel free to 
let me copy the code let me copy here only and run it see <clears throat> this is the snake okay this is the food this is the score or high score okay i will uh, run it okay see you can customize your snake your uh, food everything see the score previous time the score was 10 the high score now it changes okay the score is 30 now i am enjoying the game so this is how you can customize your you know game okay let me play the game okay see this is how you can make any game or any small small game in two two three three minutes okay so uh, go to chat gpt and you want the you know change the color of the snake or the food anything you can do using chat gpt okay so well this uh, we have to come end of this video i hope you found this video informative and interesting if you like this video give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends also if you have any queries about this video this particular video please feel free to ask in the comment section below our team will get back to you as soon as possible and the course link for the ai ml is provided in the description box below don't forget to check it out and till then thank you and keep learning Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.